Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 30th of December 1922, the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics, better known as the USSR, was founded. The constitutional basis for the Soviet Union had been agreed on the 29th of December. The Treaty on the Creation of the USSR and the Declaration of the Creation of the USSR was approved by delegations from all the founding countries. It officially came into force when it was confirmed by the First Congress of Soviets and signed by the heads of each republic's respective delegation. In 1922, the Soviet Union consisted of just four Soviet republics, the Russian SFSR, Ukrainian SSR, Belarusian SSSR and Transcaucasian SFSR, although it's important to note that the Russian and Transcaucasian SFSRs actually incorporated a number of separate Soviet Socialist Republics. The creation of the USSR therefore effectively created a centralised federal government. This was an important step for the Bolsheviks, who, having won the Russian Civil War, needed to consolidate their gains into a formal political entity. Stalin in particular argued that the new economic policy that followed war communism required centralised control, which threatened some national groups. At the same time, some Bolsheviks hoped for a world revolution that would overthrow capitalist governments around the globe. The USSR's founding documents therefore allowed Soviet republics to withdraw from the Union at any time, even though none actually did so before the collapse of the Soviet Union in 1991. New members were similarly allowed to join the Union at any time, which allowed the USSR's membership to grow from four republics in 1922 to 16 in 1940.